Scott, you're there. Welcome. Obviously, the trials were not what you had wanted it to be. Uh, that half marathon in Michigan, uh, a lot of people felt like that's kind of the Scott Fobble we're used to. Did you feel like that was you? Certainly more so than any other race or any other kind of single day um, since the trials. If On your long list of goals to finish out the year strong, but what, what would you say is you know kind of top of mind goal-wise going into Sunday? I think we can get focused on times and we can get focused on splits and stuff like that, but um, all my PVs have come from racing. So I'm going in there with the goal of, of winning, and I think anything great that comes from that will be a product of the racing. We are down in Chandler, Arizona. We're about 36 hours or so from race morning. And uh, yeah, hopefully getting ready to run a fast time. My body feels really good and the workouts have gone really well, especially in the last two weeks. Uh, I'm going into this thing with like pretty much 100% confidence that my body's gonna hold up and it will be a matter of like, am I fit enough? Can I be tough enough? Can I make the right decisions? He's capable of winning tomorrow. I mean, I think that's the thing. That's what he stated. And you know, I, I will say this. He said that before the trials too, as we were in the last couple of weeks, and it just didn't feel like, it just didn't feel like he meant it. And I and I don't mean he was lying, but I think he was forcing himself to say that and forcing himself to believe that, whereas I think this time that belief is real. It's natural, it's organic, it comes from what he's done, not what he wants to do, and that's very healthy. I was 12th of the trials and most of the guys are back here. You know, uh, Matt McDonald, Colin Beanie, those guys are all in the field. I think that there will be a solid group to race in the last four or five miles. I'm gonna go out in the lead group. I'm going to sit in the back of it. I'm gonna be trying to be really, really relaxed. If I'm able to be there at the end racing for the win, I'm gonna wait until I think I can make the move all the way to the finish line. So. Um, you know, if I can be there and if I can do that, and if I even if I get beat, if I can give myself a shot to win and take a shot at it, take a swing, um, if someone comes out on top, that's fine. But I want to be there with a shot to win at the end. Ten seconds, I will turn it over to our race starter. Athletes to your marks. Here we go, just like that, we are on our way to I didn't PR and I didn't win, but I was in the lead group for a long time. I weathered some hard miles and I fought all the way through. I fought every single step. So I was 209, 30 something, I think, and uh, I'm proud of it today. Like I, I don't have necessarily like the euphoria and the jubilation of a PR or having won, but I am really proud of this. This was a long time coming and you know, if you had asked me in June if I'd ever run 209 again, and if I was going to be really honest with you, I don't, I don't know that I would have said yes. So, to put another one on the board, to really take a step in a positive direction, uh, this was a good day.
in my entire career. I think I can win Boston. I think I can podium in New York and maybe win it. Um, I think given the right day on the right course, I could run 207. I think I can make an Olympic team. I think I might be able to medal at a world championships or an Olympics. My wildest dreams, those are the things that I see myself doing. And at my lowest moments, like holding on to those dreams and like trying to get myself to see those dreams has been really hard. We're hoping that this fall will kind of be a way to right the ship really in 2020 and not kind of see this as an entirely wasted year. This is kind of my prime and I don't want to spend the next three or four years kind of wasting opportunities. Um, so I'm all in for this, this marathon project and uh, just kind of an opportunity to salvage something positive from the last 12 months.